Well, happening this month, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and the AIS Cancer Center at Adventist Health is welcoming people to stop by and celebrate our local survivors while also raising awareness. Joining us in studio, we have Lindsay Cervantes with the AIS Cancer Center and Adventist Health. Thank you for stopping by. Of course, thank you for having me. And I love that it's a month-long event, and we're always promoting, you know, get your mammograms, mm -hmm. do those self-exams, all the awareness, all the things, but you make it fun. Tell us about tomorrow's event. Tomorrow's event is VI Pink. It's the breast event of the year. <laughs> but I'm <laughs> Uh, we are so excited to host Kern County. It is the 10 year anniversary of the AIS Cancer Center. So we started the AIS Cancer, San Cancer Center in 2013. We knew that there was a need in Kern County for localized cancer care. So we filled it. And uh, it's been amazing to see all the progress that we've made and lives that we've touched. So yeah, we're really excited for it. I love that you don't have to travel out of town to get to a specialist. You have people right here. And even if you've never had a problem, you never have a, anybody in your family who has a history, it's always good to get checked out. Right. right. So we have a lot of preventative care, genetic testing, different services that we offer that will make sure that we can target if you have maybe some family history or even if you're just curious if you're prone to cancer and you don't have that family history behind it. So there's tons of services that we offer for that. And I remember talking last year about VI Pink and it was really billed as a great event for families, husbands come and support your wives, friends come and support those survivors. But I think this is a great girlfriend event too because it's better to talk about uncomfortable things if you've got a gal pal by your side, right? Oh, 100%. Yeah, yeah. my girlfriends and I are always checking Checking in on each other, mm -hmm. checking in on our health, our mental health. You know how this generation is. But I love that we can talk about it. We <laughs> yes. are reducing that stigma. Of course. And also raising the awareness of breast cancer health makes that easier to talk about too. Absolutely. Yeah. And VI Pink this year is totally girls night out. We want the guys to come too. Yeah. Um, guys, guys wear pink too. <laughs> and uh, we're really excited because we have vendors. We're going to have a survivor fashion show cool. where they're going to share some stories from our survivors. They're going to, you know, get to be able to go out on the runway, feel beautiful, and Kiyoshi and Maddie from KGT are emceeing, so we're really excited to have them, uh, but it's gonna be really great. Just fantastic. So this is happening tomorrow, October 5th, starting at 5.30. Don't miss it, it's the eighth annual, it's a big fun night. Do we need to register or just show up? Just show up. Okay. Just come, bring your mom, bring your dad, bring your boyfriend, your husband, your girls. Everyone is welcome. It's a free event for the community and it's really just to shed awareness on breast cancer, preventative care, and our amazing Kern County survivors. I just love those survivors. We're so proud of them and their hard won battles. We will be right back with much more in Kevin's forecast because he's promising you a beautiful night tomorrow. Kevin, thank you. <laughs> we'll be right back.